YouTube, how's everyone doing? It's Big Country Time and we're back with another video. Today's video is going to be strictly on Mystery Grill. It's not just any Mystery Grill, it is the Stocked Stuffing Box. Alright, so this box is valued at $220. Uh, I think the purchase price was $145 ish. Uh, I think $30 shipping. So uh, it's guaranteed $220. Uh, they're guaranteed a signature pop, a grill. That's $40 plus. Um, I'll put the little advertisement up there. Um, let's see, there's 12 items, two large pops, rights, 10 inch pops, one grill pop over 40. Autograph pop, a non funko item, uh, two regular pops, a still funko soda, and it's four smaller items. All right, so let's get into this box. Let's just start doing it right now. All right, I'm gonna put it down here to the side. You open it, it is taking up a lot of room. I don't know if it's double boxed or not. So let's start checking it out. Um, I did do this last year. This is the second time they've done this box. All right. So right off on the top, there is a scratcher. So I'm gonna kind of lift it up over here. Maybe I can balance it and kind of angle it off to the side. There is some peanuts in here. So it's gonna be kind of a messy. Oh man, so there is a giant pop right on the top. Kind of liking it. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to balance it, so I'm sending it back down. Um, I was going to try to pull the big pot, but let's start off with something smaller. Alright, let's go with the smaller pops. They kind of ride on top. Alright, you ready guys? One, two, three. All right, so we have a Entertainment Earth exclusive Sebastian from The Little Mermaid. All right, that's a cool start. It is, uh, it is Disney. My wife likes to keep the Disney ones, so that's a pretty cool one. It is newer, and it looks like it just came out last year. As you can tell on the, the bottom, this little logo means it's a newer pop. All right, so we'll put that over there, pop number one, all right? So this is supposed to be over $220 of value. All right, here comes the second pop, all right? One, two, three. Bam, Wakanda forever. All right, that's just kind of a basic uh, pop, no, no exclusive, newer, there you go. This also came out in 22. Um, it was a good movie, I like the movie. Uh, would have liked to have got, who would I have liked to have gotten? Um, hmm. Yeah, I guess they're all about the same. Those are the ones you could have got. Oh, Yoi, I think that's how you say it. Won't be keeping that one. That one will be up for sale. All right. All right, so that's the second one in the box. Here is a, I think it's a non-Funko related item. It's, oh man, it's not coming out. It's stuck. I got a candy. The peanuts are all stuck in it. <coughs> oh, right. Oh, look at that. It is Vinyl Vader Funko Kiss Demon Robot. That's kind of cool. A little dusty. I don't think I've ever seen this, but it's pretty cool. So this looks like it's kind of older. This is from 2012. And it is, it is Funko. So that's kind of cool. Might uh, find a home for that. Uh, stick that over there. This area is going to get really full really fast. All right. So last last year's box, uh, I did okay. I got a sign, one sign pop, 
It was uh, right here. This is my only sign pop. I got that last year. Allison from the Umbrella Academy. So hopefully I get something that I really want, Star Wars related. I know Seven Bucks Pop has done some Star Wars ones. And my, my grill pop was a Star Wars, but it was a it was a duplicate. Alright, so there we go. We have a mini. <clears throat> this one's a little not just dirt or what, but Iron Man. A little mini. Pretty cool, pretty cool. So, but yeah, so I was pretty happy with last year's. Alright, here we go. We have something Star Wars related. We got, we have Chewbacca. I think it's a, a pin. So, my first Star Wars item. Alright, that's cool, that's cool. Alright, I don't know what is my sign pop and what is my grill pop. Alright, so there we go. This is, is that, uh, is that Dr. Doom crossover with uh, Venom? I don't know. Alright, so yeah, there's supposed to be some smaller items. Here's a small. I don't really collect these, but it's a enamel pin. It's Robin. Too bad it uh, wasn't Batman. I have some Batman collection, but that's pretty cool. I don't think that will sit there right there. Cellophane up here. Okay, so there's my grill pops and my side pops. I don't want to do them. Let's go for. Ooh, we got our sealed soda can, Godzilla. Probably open this up. See if I got a chase. We'll do that after I have everything out here. Um, we got to the 10 inch. Pop or uh, pop, what is it called? The uh, ride. I right, got penis going everywhere. Uh, so this this one is pretty nice. It's a black light and it is a 10 inch pop. What do you guys think it is? All right. So one, two, three. Bam! Look at that. Galactus with Silver Surfer. I think this one had a chase, but still pretty cool. Was this the one that had the chase? But dang, look at that. That's, that's huge. Oh, excuse me. Ah, all right, so I'm going to put this back over here. Bam, look at that. Woo! All right, so I got to pick up all these little peanuts that fell out. All right, so we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Should have one more item in this box. Candy. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I got two more in there. Um, um, twelve items in each box. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And I got two in there. All right, I'm gonna have to go through all these peanuts down here. But let's do the grill pop first. All right, one, two, three. We have Mark Hamill, limited edition, exclusive. So I believe I have 
this one already. So like last year, I got a duplicate. Uh, so yeah, this was the one I have already. So, but it is a cool pop, you know, it's Mark Hamill. Star Wars kind of related. He's he's playing the Joker right there. He's got the same outfit as the Joker. So that is uh, definitely a cool one. That is the Grail. This is the only time I've gotten a Grail is in these boxes. All right, so sign pop. All right, you guys ready for the sign pop? One, two, three, bam! Here we go. It is Pokemon. My first Pokemon pop ever getting. Sylveon. So I guess this is uh, the person who plays the voice of Sylveon. So that is pretty cool. Not bad, not bad. And it's uh, JSA certified. But uh, yeah, that's pretty nice. I don't know what the value of that is. It's a newer Pokemon pop. It just came out in. Let's see where. That's 21, 2021. <clears throat> so there's, that's what a Grail sticker looks like. Uh, I bought somewhat like 22 separate uh, purchases and never got one of those. So now we see the sticker again. Okay, so we are supposed to have 12 items in this box. Let me recount it again. again my, my math is... Not always the best. <clears throat> so two large pops, rides, 10 inch pop, etc. So I'm not sure if this counts for a chewer, a chewfer, because it says two large pops. No, that's two large pops, right? Uh, one girl pop over 40, that's this one. Um, autograph pop. A non Funko item, a Chomp or a Hakari. Huh, I don't know. I don't know if that's considered a Chomp or Hakari. Because it's. I don't know. Two regular pops, so those are two regular pops. One still Funko soda, and four smaller items. Twelve. Alright, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11. All right, so. <clears throat> I do not know. Got another candy in here. But no other 12th item. Alright, so that's it. We'll have to check it out. I'm not sure if if uh, this is going to count as uh, a two for or not. And I got one scratcher. So let's look at this, and then uh, we'll take a break and go for for value. All right. I've been too lucky on these sodas lately. Alright. There we go. Just a common. One in 10,500. You guys want to see what it looks like? Cool, cool. All right, so um, we can't really do the pop with right because we got a bunch of varying items here. Uh, I think the last time I checked, this one was close to, I think, sixty or seventy dollars. Um, sign pops. 
usually go for around a uh, hundred or so. So that would be that would be a big value right there, about 180, I'm thinking. So, but um, let's take a break and we'll write everything down and we'll see how we did on value, right? Be right back. All right, we are back and we got good value. We got good value. Everything was able to be found on the um, pot price guide. Um, I recounted everything. I have 11 items. So I'm gonna reach out to, you know, Mystery Grill to see what happened. Uh, we'd love to get another item, but we did get good value. Um, so we'll start off um, with Galacticus. This is not the chase. This is the common. And um, there was a lot of these, <clears throat> but uh, this one's coming in at $24. It's a, it's a big item and hard to resell. Uh, but I'll probably keep it. Um, I do have a lot of black light pops, so that's 24. <clears throat> and then Gene Simmons, there is a gold one like this, which is like $155. This one is valued at 33. That's pretty amazing for it to be 2012. So pretty cool, pretty cool. All right. And then Dr. Doom. This is uh, Venomized Dr. Doom. It uh, has PBG value of $5, <clears throat> which I didn't think it was going to be in there, but it was in there, $5. Uh, and I did find the Chewbacca pin. This is uh, from the Smuggler's Bounty Box. Um, this one shows $4. Um, I'm gonna come over here at Robin. Robin comes in at $7. All right. Um, I'll have to double check this because this said this is a limited edition Godzilla and uh, just the common is $24. So that's pretty pretty high for a uh, opened uh, soda non-chase. So we'll see. It is pretty cool. Um, Iron Man. This uh, one comes in at $8. Alright. And then for the Little Mermaid Pop. Um, shows twenty dollars ppg so it is a you know exclusive and then we have wakanda coming in at twelve dollars and then down here mark hamill it's, it is a duplicate like i said i have it already so that one it's come down in value i think it's coming in at 55 still respectable it meets the um Mystery Grill, uh, uh, Grail, they have it at $40. Okay, so uh, Mark Hamill, 55 And then down here for the sign pop uh, by Erica Schroeder. All right, so she does the voice, and that one's coming at $90. So for a total of $282. So I think what I said, they guarantee $220. Is that what I said? I can't remember now. Let's show, double check. Double check. Uh, guarantee at least $220 value. And it's a 12 item in each box. So, did not get 12 items. Uh, I do not think the candy or the scratcher counts, but 500 on the scratcher. So that's everything. Uh, pretty good, pretty good, pretty cool, pretty happy with it. Uh, I will probably get this again next year when they do it. I like doing the variations of Mystery Grill. Uh, kind of slowed down on the regular boxes, um, but these are pretty cool. I get a little variety. Um, so I'll probably keep the sign pop. Um, I will keep the black light pop. And I'm gonna keep the pen because it's Star Wars. This one's probably going to be a gift for someone, but all the other stuff's probably going to be for sale. So if you guys want to uh, let me know before I put it up, let me know, make a deal. But other than that, that is it. Remember, Mystery Grail. What? Because you're out.